Hello everybody and welcome back to Encodia. My name is of course Constantine and of course we are back. We are back with Tina here and Sam uh, to try to hopefully in this episode uh, stop the electricity here at the back of the diner's alley. So in the previous episode we actually managed to get ourselves uh, these keys over here, the electrician keys. And I have a feeling we may be able to open up something with these. Not quite sure but I'm hoping that this is going to work. So the only thing we can interact with here is going to be the uh, wire. Uh, but not the electricity box. So maybe we gotta find where this is, um... Where this is located, though. You know what? This is not gonna work. Hold up. Let me try to find an electricity box somewhere that we can interact with. Uh, I mean, I'm pretty sure... There's nothing here, right? At the same time, I really might want to make my way back there, but it doesn't like this is gonna work. So, uh, let me look for an electricity box somewhere. We have to find some sort of an electricity box around here somewhere, and I'm guessing it's gonna be probably on the left side, uh, not back there. So let's see, we got an abandoned store and a fuse box. Can I go inside the abandoned store? This automatic door is broken. Mm. It won't open. Just as I thought so. So, in order to open up this thing, I may need to fix up the fuse box. It seems broken. Something must be missing. Uh, what if I choose Sam here and look at it? Let's see. Maybe he knows better. It controls the door. It should work with a new fuse. All right. Well, we do have a fuse. I'm not quite sure if this one is good or not. Actually, hold up. This is a capacitor. Let's try. But I'm not sure if this is gonna work. Right yeah, this is not a fuse. This is a capacitor, so it's not gonna work. Interesting. And I'm pretty sure if I want to go inside here, it's not going to work either. Alright, well, in that case, um, let me keep on going then. Let me keep on going on this side, maybe, and try to see what else we can find. Oh! Actually, no, that's, that, that's the cyber junkie. I thought I could interact with the car there, but that's not working. Come on, buddy. Come faster. I want you to look at the old gate. What is he doing? Completed in 1791. It's one of the few old structures preserved in Neo Berlin. Hmm. Yeah, unfortunately, I feel like the keys that we got, uh, we may actually need to use them somewhere else. So, let me try to make my way out of here. Let's see if uh, there are other locations that need uh, these keys. Interesting. Nothing over here. Uh, electrical panel. Again, I'm pretty sure I cannot use anything on I this one, a right? Token. A token. I mean, these are keys. These are not tokens, so this is not going to work. Alright, uh, let me keep on going then. Let me try to see what else we can do. I'm happy that we use this stick, though, to grab the keys from the electrician, uh, from the electrician but I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do next. Uh, to do the console, it's out of order. Uh, can I actually maybe use the keys on it? Hold up. No, 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 no. Go back, go back. Uh, what if I try to go back to the shelter? I know that back here we had this panel box. Uh, and I have a feeling that now that I have the keys, I may actually be able to use this and open it up. There we go. So that is how you do it. And if I turn this off... Oh, never mind. We got a fuse. Nice. Is that a fuse? Yes, it is. And I feel like this is exactly what we needed uh, in order to progress here. So, let me go with the map again. Uh, make my way back to the historical quarter. There we go. And I feel like we got everything we need in order to go inside the abandoned store. So, let me try to uh, once again use the fuse with this. There we go, guys. Hey. We got it. That's awesome. Now, this is exactly why I chose the hard mode on this game, because I've been playing point-and-click adventure games all my life. And for me, this is uh, kind of easy. Uh, at the moment, I haven't really came across any puzzles that are way too difficult. Um, I guess we're going to have to wait and see how this goes. But for now, we are all good. Alright, so we found the pliers. Perfect. I feel like we gotta use these pliers to cut the uh, electrified wires. But first of all, we gotta turn off the electricity. 
Uh, a pair of socks. Oh, hold up. This is what we needed. There we go. <laughs> we finally got a pair of socks. Awesome. So that's completed. Um, what else? Hmm. What else? Don't even know. I want to go back to the old gate. Oh, hold up. There's a shirt here. An old shirt. Let's check it out. A plaid shirt. Pretty intact. A plaid. Can I grab it's it? Too big for me. Oh, what about if I use uh, Sam? Can he grab it? Too big for Tina. Too small for me. <laughs> too big for Tina. Too small for you. Hmm. Well, I just wanted to grab it. Maybe I could use it as something else. I don't know. But apparently not. Uh, let's see, what else? It doesn't like we can do anything around here, though. Other than the pliers and the socks. I feel like this is what we can do right here. I wonder if we can actually use the pliers on the wire, even if the electricity is still on, though. Let me just check out the shirt. A flat shirt. Hmm. Flat shirt. Is there anything I can do with it? Doesn't really look like it, though. Alright, well, in that case, uh, let me try to make my way then to uh, the diner. Oh, meanwhile, in the New Berlin City Hall. It's not there! So what if it's not there? Keep looking! I need to get to that server now! <laughs> the cyberspace breach is unrelated. It is his signature. Yes, eight years later. Do your job, or do I have to come down there myself? <laughs> I love his German accent. Unrelated. <laughs> Incompetent, every one of them. All right, so hopefully some things are gonna change around here, though. Uh, now that that happens, love it. Uh, let's see here. So, if I go to the right side this time and uh, try to go into down an alley, can we now chop down the cable? There we go. And let me try to actually use, uh, let's see, the pincers or the pliers with the cable. Oh, there we go. That worked. Awesome. And this means we can now simply cross. Without any issues. And maybe something good to eat in there. Hmm. Is there? Can we grab something? Ah, snap. The that cat is not going to allow us. Very angry. It's better to get rid of it first. All right. Let's get rid of it then. Uh, let me try to use the fish with the cat. There we go. It works. <laughs> Perfect. And now, can I grab some leftovers? Hey. This lasagna looks good. There we go. We got some lasagna. I wonder. Is it good? Yes, it is. Find edible foods. All right. So we still need to find two more things here. We still need to find the patch for the shelter canopy. And we need to find the, the uh, robot oil for Sam. So let's see here. What else can we find around here? Can we look through the leftovers some more? Good? Let me look for some more. Maybe we can find some more stuff. Nothing more in there. All right, nothing more. Just as I thought. Um, hmm. I do see a set of stairs here, but I'm not quite sure if I can use it though. Yeah, it doesn't like it doesn't like we can climb up there, and it doesn't like there's anything else around this alleyway. All right, well, I feel like we are done for now. Uh, let me make my way then. Let's see. Let me make my way back into uh, the uh, city. Alright, let's see what else we can do. So, can I keep on chatting with this fella? Oh, I saw the cop car. Hi there. Hey, kid. What's up? Um, do you know where I can find a token for the elevator? Alright, let's go with that. Do you know where I can find a token for the elevator? What for? Well, I want to see what's on the terrace. Been there a few times. Nothing interesting. You must have had a lot of tokens then. Uh, not really. I just have one, but it's rigged, so I can use it multiple times. Cool. Can you let me use it once then? Uh... Come on, kids. I don't know. Please. Well, I like riddles. Do you? 
Sure. Okay, then. You tell me two secret words. I'll give you the elevator token. Challenge accepted. Here, take this holographic prism. What? I gotta tell him two secret Show words? Secret words that hackers have hidden around Neo Berlin. Hmm. Cool. Where should I look? The first word is hidden on a big door. The second one is disguised by a foreign language. Um, okay. I'll think about it and look around. See ya. What? So the first uh, word is on a big door. But the second one is on a foreign language. Maybe on a Chinese sign or something like that? A large door. Uh, you know what? I have a feeling I know. I think I know. Let me check something here. So the first door, he says a large door. So I'm guessing he means this large gate here. So if I go ahead and grab... Let's see. If I go ahead and grab the holographic prism. And I use it with the old gate. Look at that. Blue. There we go. Alright, so one of the words is blue. Uh, the next one is going to be a foreign language, right? That's what he said. Um, yeah, let's see here. Let me try to use this with a sign then. So that's not good. Renzo's. Actually, maybe it's Renzo's? Let's try it. Nope, that's not working. Alright, any other signs I can use around here? Maybe not in this section. I feel like I gotta go somewhere else. Yeah, I feel like I gotta go to a new location. So let me make my way then uh, back to the long road. And keep on exploring and see any some other signs. All right, let's see here. Where do we have some more signs around here? So we cannot read that sign. Can I interact with that sign? Uh, I don't see no signs around here either. That's just a timetable. That's just a rotating ad, I guess. I'm thinking, I think this guy is talking about this sign, the signboard, because this is definitely on a foreign language. So let me try to use the prism again with this one. There we go. So we got blue sky. Perfect. Yeah. We got them both. <laughs> All right, let me go back then. Let me try to go back and chat with the kid again. Hopefully this kid is going to leave uh, this prism with me because I have a feeling I am going to need to discover more words, more secret words around the world. Hey, buddy. I got your secret words. Chat. Hi there. Hey, kid. What's up? Uh, so about the riddle. So about the riddle. Yes? I found the two words. Nice. Let's hear them. Blue sky. Yes. Congratulations. There we go. We got it. Here, take the elevator token. Oh, I love it. So now we can go up the elevator. Oh, look at this. You're welcome. It was fun playing with you. Same here. I'm sure we'll meet again. Someday. Maybe. But not before you turn at least 10. <laughs> Bye. Goodbye. I love it. So this guy has been really helpful. Uh, and apparently we still have the prism, which is great. Meaning I could definitely use that in order to discover more secrets in the game. That is so cool. Alright, well in that case, let me make my way back to the bus stop and try to use the elevator. There we go, buddy. So, if I go ahead and use the token with... No, no, come here. Wait, where's that elevator, though? I think I passed it. Yeah, I definitely passed it. Let me go back then. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, the elevator is actually right over here. <laughs> Alright, so if I use the prism now... Actually, not the prism, but the uh, token with this. There we go. We can now go up the elevator. I love it. <laughs> and this is actually taking us up? Awesome. Oh man, we can now look at the city from the top. <laughs> Alright, unfortunately we cannot interact with any building in the background there. I do see a diner sign. Terraces. Alright, there we go. Uh, what can we find here? Let's see. So, I see another waterproof flag. Uh, you know what? I feel like we're gonna need this to patch 
uh, our home. Yeah, look at that. Find the patch for the shelter canopy. There we go. So ultimately, we need to find the oil for Sam. Is this all we had to come up here for? Hmm. That is weird. So this means we still need to find the adapter though for the RAM. Um, but I have no idea where to find that though. Uh, let me try to chat with Sam here for a second. Sam? Yes, Tina? How old are you? I'm nine years old. No, I already asked I'm about that. Okay, okay, I know. Uh, let me switch between them and uh, chat with Tina with Tina? Yes, Sam? Sam. Are you feeling all right? I'm fine. No need to ask me all the time. Hmm. All right, so nothing we can do around here, unfortunately, though. All right, well, in that case, uh, next up, I got to figure out how to uh, create an adapter or where to grab an adapter for the robot. Uh, let me switch back to Tina. Again, I don't see anything around here that I can use. No adapters, no nothing. Maybe new characters have shown up in the world. I don't know. <laughs> I'm loving this animation with the elevator. It's so cool. All right. Uh, next up, then, let me try to get out of this place and see uh, if we can find some more stuff. Uh, can I try to chat with the robot again with Tina? Hello there. Okay, so he's not gonna be able to chat with me once again. This, uh, this is the console that's gonna be out of order. It's a console for copying data from robots, but it's out of order at the moment. Hmm. Uh, hold up. Could I maybe use the screwdriver with it, or the wrench? Actually, I should say. It's not working this way. It's not working. I feel like I gotta grab an adapter from somewhere. I just don't know exactly know from where though. Oh. There's the capacitor. What if I try to use a floppy disk with this? Wrong choice. Wrong choice. What if I try to use the robots to do something with the console? I guess out of order means it's out of order. Um use this with it? Negative. Negative. Hmm. Hold up, let me try to chat with the uh, robot some more. Maybe he's gonna tell me something. What? Uh, regarding your RAM. Regarding your RAM? Yes? What was I supposed to get you again? Oh, running after the whiny human fried some circuits, huh? <laughs> Bring me a 288 to 184 pins adapter and I'll help you get the robot oil. Uh, thanks. Hurry along now. I don't want to ruin... Dang it. Now, I know that it, I need that uh, adapter. The problem is, I'm having difficulties uh, figuring out where to find that adapter. I am stuck right now. Let me try looking for some more stuff then on this side. Oh, you know what? Hold up. I think I know. I think I know who's buying all this stuff. Uh, yeah, I think I figured it out. I think it's this fella from our shelter. He's definitely the one selling the adapter. So let me chat with him. Good day. Hi there. Oh, uh, that's AM53. You're pretty worn out, mate, for an eight to nine year old. That's because I've been living on the streets. Oh, that's unfortunate. It's lucky they used waterproof paint to coat you. It sounds like you are familiar with my model. Yes, at nine I teach robotics at the Neo Berlin University. But listen, I shouldn't be talking with other robots. Polino is very jealous. Who's Polino? My pet. But really, I cannot talk anymore. Sorry. Nothing personal. Alright, buddy. Don't worry. I'm gonna use the kid then to chat with you. Uh, chat. Excuse me. Uh, uh, yes? Uh, who are you? What are you doing here? Am I safe? Uh, do you by any chance have uh, an adapter? There we go. You have by any chance a 288 to 184 pins RAM adapter? Of course I do. It does. I knew I it. hundreds of items <laughs> within the pockets of my There jacket. we go. Awesome. Can you give it to me? Sure. It's 79 oh, million Berlin dang it. credits. I don't have that. But since I like you, I sell it to you for 59 credits. I don't have any money. Is there something I can barter with? Um... Maybe I can trade it for a capacitor. Perfect. We have that. Sometimes you can even find capacitors on the ground. But I don't want to leave this corner. I feel safe here. 
So if you could get one for me, I would be very thankful. Okay, I'll go look for a capacitor. And if I find it, in exchange, you'll give me the RAM adapter. Yes, good luck. There we go. We got exactly what he needs. All right, well, in that case, let me go ahead and grab the adapter, the capacitor, actually. Give it to him and uh, get ourselves the adapter that we needed. That capacitor. Uh, uh, yes? I found one. Here, take it. Oh, very nice. Thank you. Here's your RAM adapter. There we go. We got it. Perfect. That was awesome. Very good. That's exactly nice what I needed. Here. My pleasure, little girl. Have a nice day. You too. Goodbye. All right, we are done. Now, let me make my way back into town then, because uh, next up we have to give the adapter to the robot. So that hopefully he's going to help us here and uh, help us with that oil for the robot that we needed. Hey, buddy. All right, hold up. Let me choose Sam and let me chat with him again. What? Regarding your RAM. Yes? Here is the 288 to 184 pins adapter. Oh, well, should I say thank you? Because I won't, but <laughs> I guess I owe you one. Follow me. There we go. Finally, we're getting the oil that we needed. Thank you. <laughs> All right, we're even now. Hope you won't bother me again. Goodbye. Oh man, there we go. We finally did it. Uh, we finished all the tasks that we had to do. That is great. Definitely wanted to do this for sure. Uh, let me chat with Tina here. Tina. Yes, Sam. Are you feeling? I'm fine. I don't know. She's feeling alright. I think uh, next up, all I gotta do is just make my way back to the shelter. All right. Go back to the rooftop. And we're done. Look at that. A successful day. I'm pleased to report that I'm at 34% charge. Oh, no! Huh? Oh, what happened? What the heck? The police. They must have clocked us last night. Tina, I do not think they were here to arrest us for loitering. A few minutes later, after sorting out their, uh, their stuff, I guess. I still don't get why they raided our shelter. According to my calculations, there is an 87% chance that the intruders searched for an object they were unable to find. We have to find out what happened. I believe if we look around the rooftop, we may find clues. Ah, uh, interesting. So apparently we've been raided, but... Question is by whom? We got a dirty doll. Let's check that out. This wasn't here before. <laughs> It looks so weird. Uh, we got a copper wire. There we go. Uh, should I also grab the teddy bear? My old teddy bear. It's so dirty now. Yeah, let me try to grab it. I don't need it. She doesn't need it. Hmm. Alright. Um, hmm. I wonder. Oh, we can interact with the power box. Let me go ahead and try to interact with it. I feel like we something is wrong. Electricity from that neon sign. Oh, no. Never mind. Apparently, it's working... Perfectly. A bunch of useful things I've collected. Hmm. I mean, it doesn't look like there's anything out here. I don't see any clues or anything, which is quite weird. Uh, rooftop. Hold up, you guy. I need you to move away. So I can see if there's anything back here. So we cannot go to the right side there. Uh, our mission right now is to discover what happened to the shelter. Needs a patch to keep the rain out. Uh, what if I use? Oh, hold up. Where is that patch that I found? It was a flag, right? Doesn't like I can find it in my inventory. Nah. <laughs> hmm. Well, at the moment, I don't really see anything around here that I could use. So I'm not quite sure. Yeah, I'm not quite sure if you can find anything. So let me go to the left side. Maybe we can find something here. Uh, what do we got here? We got the tank. And apparently that's about it. Oh! Electricity pole. And a watching drone. 
Oh, you know what? Maybe the watch zone has seen something. Yeah, maybe he's recorded something. Let me chat with it. I have a feeling I'm gonna have to use the robot Excuse though. Me? Is this working? I'm not allowed to talk with humans. Oh. But it's very important. Sorry, I can't. Damn. Alright, let me try to use uh, the bot then to chat with them. Hey buddy, chat with me then. Good evening, CASS59. Good evening, SAM53. Um, hmm. what can you see from up here? Let's what can see. you see from up there? My high res setting has a 158.6 degree view angle, and I can zoom up to 50 times. It means I can see you've been loitering around today, and that's <laughs> forbidden. I should report you. No, don't do that. Consider your camera system. Considering your camera system, is there any chance you recorded what happened here in the last few hours? Most probably, yes. And is there any chance you can show me? Not really. My recordings are property of Neo Berlin police. You are not authorized to access them. It's very important. The well-being of this little girl may depend on it. I'm not programmed to care, you know. I understand. Something else? Thank God. So we gotta do something with this bot in order to get information from him, though. Isn't it boring flying back and forth? <laughs> Isn't it boring flying back and forth that way? No, it's very cool actually. I can see lots of naughty things. Like what? Oh, this morning I watched a hungover electro rat. It was puking all over a cyber addict's shoes. Very funny. Um, I do not find that entertaining at all. Is this what you report to the police? That and things like a robot and a human living unauthorized on a rooftop. Uh. I think I better change the subject. Yes. <laughs> oh, nothing really. I better go. Dang it. This guy is not helpful at all. Um, I feel like I gotta get the information from him though, somehow. Uh, let me see if I can do something to the electricity pole here. High voltage power line. High voltage power line. Uh, what if I use the pliers to cut this as the robot passes by so that the uh, no. electricity falls on him? No. Uh, use the keys on it. This key doesn't fit here. This key doesn't fit here. Uh, what if I use a wrench with it? No. Hmm. Wrong. Dang it. Uh, hold up. Let me activate this. I want to see how this looks. <laughs> Man, the vintage looks so cool, though. I love it that we can apply a filter like that. A water tank for firefighters and sweepers. So discover what happened to the shelter. How can I? Can I use the stick it with the? Work this way. It doesn't work this way. Uh, let me choose uh, Tina and look at this. Let's see what she's gonna say. It's very, very tall. Yeah, I know. Only the robot can do anything with it, but I don't know what to do with this electricity pole, though. I'm a little bit confused here. Dirty doll. Uh, let me switch back to this fella. Use the copper wire with it the dirty doll? Work. No. Use the copper wire. Actually, this doll with this that. Way. Use the copper wire with this? Wrong. Hmm. Can I combine the stick with Maybe. the copper wire? Oh, Good. we did. Look at that. And can I use this with the electricity? Maybe. No. I wonder why, though. Long copper stick. A long stick, a few turns of copper wire are wound around the tip. I wonder why though. I wonder why we'd put the uh, copper on the tip. Huh. That is interesting. Can I actually choose the girl and use the uh, stick with Not this? Working. Not working. Hmm. Uh, can I maybe use the wrench with this? Not working this way. No. In the pipe? It doesn't work. No. Alright, well in that case, let me go back on the street level. I feel like uh, maybe they do it at the bottom. Leave. I need to figure out what happened. Uh-huh. Alright, so we cannot leave. We cannot do anything at the moment, unfortunately. Alright, well, um, let me try to uh, then use the prism. To see if we can spot something. Nothing That's not working. Can I use this with the bot? Wait, use this with the bot. It's not working. 
Uh, dirty doll with this? No. That is weird. Use the stick with the bot? Good idea. Ah. It needs something more. But it needs something more. Uh, let me try to use him then and use it with the bot. Nice idea. But we must add something to it. Aha. Uh -huh. So we need to add something more to it, apparently. Uh, what about if I combine Doesn't the doll? This way. No. Uh, what if I combine the duct tape? No. Old cola Can't can? The vintage me device? No, it's not gonna work, of course. Uh, what about the keys? Wrong decision. <laughs> uh, the holographic prism? No. I feel like... I feel like maybe something is missing. Uh, because we definitely have to add something more to the... Um, to the cable. I feel like we gotta add something more to this long copper stick here, but I don't know exactly what. What if I try to use this with a power box? It might work. Ah. Oh, we it electrified works. it. I get it. And next up, I feel like we gotta shock the drone. Let's see if uh, this is gonna work. Alright, so if I use the stick now with the drone. <laughs> is this working? Ah, oh, there we go, we shocked it! <laughs> oh, I love it! Alright, chat with him now. Oh, I feel so good! Can you believe it? I'm flying! Flying! You don't say. Yes! I feel so good and helpful! What can I do for you? <laughs> I cannot believe this! Look at that! We actually made him uh, help us. Can I get some of uh, whatever you're having? <laughs> Let's go with that. Can I get some of whatever you're having? I'm not sure what you are talking about. I was patrolling as usual. <laughs> Everything turned colorful and joyful. I guess it was the electrified stick, but it's gone now. You should try it, man. Think of the best high you ever had. Multiply it by a hundred, and you're still nowhere near it. <laughs> Sounds promising. But oh my I god, I love it. Better things to do. All right. Anything else? All right. So apparently, once we use that stick, we don't have any inventory anymore. Let's see. Yeah, we definitely lost it. But I guess that's all we had to do with it. So, so let's see if it can actually show us uh, what happened a few hours ago. I wonder if you can show me what happened here a few hours ago. What are you talking about? Well, you are a watching drone. You have a camera. You record everything. Do I? I thought I was an entertainment bot. <laughs> Program to show little kids how colorful and strobo the world is. No, I'm afraid you work for the police. Sad. Anyway, please search your archive and show me what happened here. Well, all right. Let me search my memory card. Um... Lots of boring stuff. Do I really spend my life in a pointless job like this? I guess so. Anyway, you are free now. But we don't have a lot of time. Alright, alright. I guess I found something interesting. Let me show you. Alright, come on, buddy. You. Show me what happens. Huh. find that robot the mayor the mayor you know how many nanny bots there are in neo berlin i bet your precious mayor's just guessing there's a hidden code in one of them too you want to say that to his face no but i ain't gonna <laughs> hmm? <sighs> <laughs> are you serious right now better hope they're not looking for you <laughs> Oh, man. So that's what happens. Apparently, they're looking for my Sam. Sam, do you know what code they were talking about? I'm afraid I have no idea, Tina. Hmm. Uh, the policeman said they were looking for a robot with a secret code in it. They said Rumpf himself sent them. Uh, let's go with the first one. The policeman said they were looking for a robot with a secret code in it. Yes. There is a 98.8% probability that they were talking about me. But I've scanned my system already. 
and I haven't found anything. I think Mr. Grump is pretty dumb, but he has his eyes everywhere. So I don't think they were talking about another Sam. It must be you. Correct. But you don't know what they were talking about? I'm afraid not. I'm pretty sure the code may actually not be inside his system, but instead may be written somewhere inside the robots. Huh. They said Rumpf himself sent them. Why is the mayor looking for you? Mr. Rump won't send his private goons for minor crimes. That's what regular police are for. But I really cannot tell what could be hidden inside me that is so important. Maybe a hacker broke into your hard drive while we were sleeping. No. There's no trace of external access to my files. Interesting. If they didn't come to uh, book us for loitering, but for what? If they didn't come to book us for loitering, but for you, you must be hiding something. Yeah. I searched in my data. I found no trace of anything secret. Is your memory intact? Is your memory intact? Can you remember everything since you were built? Of course. All of my memories, as well as yours, are stored safely. Hmm. Are you 100% sure? 100% sure? Yes. Are you 100% sure? Yes. Tangents. If they didn't come to you must be hiding. I've searched in my data. Don't you have a secret sector accessible only by your maker? Let's go with that. Do you have a hidden sector accessible only by your makers? I have a drive partition dedicated to manufacturer performed maintenance. But last time I went in for maintenance, you were four years old. And anyway, it contains only standard protocols. Nothing can be hidden in it. Hmm. Let me keep on going with this one. I feel like we can get some more from him. Uh, don't you have a, a secret sector? Have you analyzed your system? Is your memory intact? So you think they're looking for the wrong robots? Uh, let me go with the second one. Have you analyzed your system? Is there anything damaged? I have. My system is 100% functional. Hmm. All right. So that's not working. Uh, let me go with I have a feeling here. I have a feeling something big's going on here. Can you tell me more? It must be something serious if Mr. Rump sent his private goons. But why you? I mean, you were just one of the hundreds of thousands Model Sams out there. What do you mean? Your words make me very sad. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You didn't mean it like no, that, buddy. Special. Come on. You're my Sam. We've been together my entire life. And I know you so well that I can't figure out why they were here for you. You've made me break the law so many times. But it's not that. Hmm. I have a feeling something big is going on. I have a feeling something big is going on. Let me go with the third one once again. I feel like he can tell me more. Uh, have you analyzed your system? Is there anything damaged? Have you analyzed your system? Is there anything damaged? I have. 100% functional. Let me keep on going with this one. Uh, is your memory intact? You remember everything. So are they looking for the wrong robot? they are looking for the wrong robot? Could be. I'm consuming a lot of battery power to try to exit a logic loop. By all indications, they were looking for the right robot. Me. But the right robot contains a secret code which I do not have. Thus, I'm not the right robot. But, by all indications, they were looking for the right robot. Me. <laughs> uh, I'm confused. Alright, so the only thing that's actually doing something here is if I go with uh, the third menu. Now, how do I... Hmm, how do I interact with them? Don't you have a secret hidden sector? Have I analyzed your system? Is your memory intact? So you think they're looking for... Let me go with three again, I guess. Is your memory intact? Can you remember everything since you... Of course. Are you 100% sure? And you found no trace of a hidden code. Can you go over them from the beginning? Yeah, I think this is what we gotta do. Can you go over them from the beginning? Deep scanning everything? It'll take a lot of time. How much? Two seconds per year of your life. You silly machine. Go on then, do it! <laughs> Alright. Um, well... What? I found a set of corrupted data. Something I should remember, but I don't. It's like... Blurred. There's also a video. Recorded in the same time period. A video? But what about the secret code? I'm afraid I don't have access to the secret code. What about the video then? I'm programmed to show it to you when you turn 10. I can't Seriously? Wait five months. I want to watch that video now. I'm afraid I can't. Sam, 
You're programmed to protect Tina. If the police take you away from me, how can I survive all alone? You have a 34% chance to survive on your own. These are not good odds. You see? We must find out more. Show me the video. All right. There we go. I need to recode the video schedule to bypass your birthday. How long will it take? Five seconds? A couple of hours. Ah, dang it. Well, at least we convinced them. A couple of hours later. There we go. Oh, look at this. Happy birthday, pumpkin. I love you so very, Is this her father? very much. And I wish I could be there with you. But if you're seeing this, it means I'm gone. And my work isn't finished. I have a mission for you. I know this isn't a burden a 10-year-old should have to shoulder, but I need... No, no, the world needs you to see this mission through. I'm sorry I can't speak plainly and make it easier for you, but there are people who know what I'm doing, and they will destroy my work if they ever find it. So in case something happens to me, I've designed its controls to respond to your DNA and to your DNA only. Inside Sam's memory is a code. Use it, and you'll find everything you need to finish my work. How to release it into the world, and save them all. I love you, Pumpkin. Be brave, my little warrior. Tell your mom I love her, and that I'm so sorry I can't be there with you both. I had a dad? Sam, I need this code. Now. I'm sorry, Tina. I do not have the means to access it. Assuming the message is accurate, however, if we wait until your 10th birthday, the code will become accessible to you. No! I won't wait five months! It is only logical. My parents are dead, Sam. But I had a father. I'm not just a donor baby, Sam. I need that code. If he needed me to complete some mission, he must have left some other clues. The message was recorded eight years ago, Tina. It doesn't matter. I need to find out who he was first. This information should be available at the Neo Berlin Registry Office. Then let's go. Alright guys, look at that. Man, we got some crazy, crazy details and information that we gotta work with next. Apparently, our mission is to save the world. And I was not expecting to be able to see her father right now. I mean, I knew that she was an orphan. And the only thing that we had here was her mom's photo. But, yeah, this is uh, definitely getting crazy. And I'm really, really excited to carry on with this adventure, guys. Anyway, that being said, thank you all very much for watching another episode of Encodia. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And, of course, if you did, a like would be very much appreciated. As that's a great way to support the channel and let everybody know that you enjoyed it and uh, everybody else should watch as well. And if you guys want to grab this game for yourselves, I will leave a link down below in the description. You can play this on the PC and Mac as well, which is absolutely epic. But that being said, guys, if you are all new here and haven't subscribed yet, do consider doing that as I'm planning to post more videos just like this one in the future every single day. And if you guys want to become a member just like these awesome fellows right here, check on out the join button at the bottom next to the subscribe one. That being said, stay safe out there, and I'll see you all in the next one soon. Bye!